Okay, so if you're here, you're interested in mass, you're interested in understanding from a physics perspective, what is mass? Before I get into it, um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. If you'd like some um, extra help, all you have to do is DM me on Instagram and um, I'll cover uh, the, whatever topic you want in a in a video okay so that's Instagram alright so in today's lesson what we're gonna be talking about is mass okay so before we do that before we delve into it and how it relates from a physics perspective what we have to do is we have to talk about what mass actually is um, so typically um, you've got a buddy and he goes how much do you weigh if he asks you that um, he's actually not asking for the mass he's asking for how much um, you weigh on the earth weight okay and mass are different okay so this is different than weight totally different things you see how much you weigh depends on where you are okay so on the earth this is the earth I weigh a little bit more this is me okay so I weigh a certain amount on the earth now on the moon I weigh a little less that's me same person okay I weigh a little less than on the moon so I weigh more on the earth than I do on the moon so this is weight so when you're on the scale you're actually measuring the weight okay the application of the force that your body exerts on the scale that's what you're measuring okay but mass mass is something totally different mass is the amount of stuff is the amount of stuff in an object that is the mass okay in the object so the the, the stuff that makes me who I am that's what um, that's what makes up my mass so if the mass is the amount of stuff in the object okay what we can say then is that mass is invariant okay what does invariant mean well invariant means not changing not changing due to reference frame okay so I can be anywhere I can be anywhere and my mass is a quantity that won't change I could be on the earth I could be on the moon I can be on Jupiter I can be on Saturn I could be on Pluto and they all exert a different force on me but me who I am doesn't change that's the mass okay so what the heck is weight then okay so weight weight equals the force of gravity due to mass okay so the mass you have okay will result in a different force of gravity applied so there's two there's two real um, dependencies here it's where I am so on what planet or what uh, you know moon or what star or whatever where I am that matters because bigger objects will apply bigger forces but also it depends on what the mass of the object is so if there's more stuff okay if there's more stuff so if you have me and a guy who's six foot six okay I'm not six foot six I'm like five seven if you have me and a guy who's six foot six the guy is, who's six foot six would have more stuff in him so his mass would be more okay which means that the force of gravity that the earth would apply to either of us 
his force of gravity would be higher. His weight would be higher. Okay, which is obvious. If you measure us on the scale, his weight would be higher than my weight. Okay, he might be, I don't know, 245 pounds, and my weight would be, I don't know, 140 pounds. All right, but that's just measuring how um, the Earth has exerted a force due to the difference in mass. Okay, so there's a difference here. Mass and weight are totally different things. All right, so the mass is the amount of stuff in an object, whereas the weight is the force of gravity that an that a certain planet or object applies to another object depending on how much mass the other object has, right? So if there's more stuff in an object, the force of gravity that, let's say, object X will apply will be greater, okay? So, so guys, that is an introduction to mass and um, what mass is, and it is so important. I can't exaggerate how much um, how important it is to distinguish between mass and weight. Those are totally different um, quantities in physics. All right, so we have to get away from that because usually in in real life we'll see as we'll see mass and weight as the exact same thing. They are they are entirely different. Okay, so mass is something that doesn't change. Your mass won't change. Okay, the mass of the Earth doesn't change. Okay, I think it's, what, 5.98 times 10 to the 24 kilograms? That doesn't change, okay? But my weight would change depending on what planet or what object I'm referring to. So if I'm on the Earth, my weight will be uh, more than on the Moon, but my weight would be more on Jupiter than it would be on the Earth or on the Moon. So, anyways, thank you so much. I hope this was informative. Um, stay woke. And if you don't mind, subscribe, like if you want more content like this. We're going to describe velocity, speed, acceleration in the next video, displacement as well. And then the video after that, we're going to describe um, forces and Newton's laws of motion. I'm excited. All right. Peace out, guys. Love you. Bye-bye.